Hi guys and welcome back to RoboRemo tutorial. I have this setup from the previous video and now I'll show how to use a text log. So I first click menu edit user interface then I add a text log here and if I leave it like this now it will display the commands received from the Arduino when I press this button it sends LED space 1 backslash n when I release sends LED space 0 backslash n and LED space 1 LED space 0 will display here in the text log now if I click edit and set ID to LED Now it will display the commands that start with LED space, so it will display 1 or 0 when I press or release that button. Now I will edit the Arduino code. Here in the execute command function you have this command. When I press the button on RoboRemo it will turn on the LED. And I want to write here serial dot println debug space arduino led turned on and I don't put backslash n because I used println there so I'm just closing this Also copy this here. Debug Arduino LED turned off. So after turning on or off the LED, it will send this to RoboRemo. Now I will upload this code to the Arduino. But before I connect the USB cable, I have to disconnect this Bluetooth module because it uses the same RX and TX pins on the Arduino, and it conflicts with the USB to serial chip which is on the back of this board so I have to disconnect this now connect USB make sure I have the right board and processor and port selected and click upload now I disconnect the USB cable put back the Bluetooth module, turn it on and let's see how it works now. Now I click connect and now this button sends LED space 1, LED space 0 backslash n to the RoboRemo which lights up this LED and writes 1 or 0 here in this text log because they both have the ID set to LED. Now this button will turn on or off that LED on the Arduino and the Arduino sends back the debug Arduino LED turned on or off. But it doesn't display here because the ID of this text log is set to LED and not to debug. So now I will edit the user interface, move this here and add another text log and I will set its ID to debug and now when I press this button it lights up the LED on the Arduino the Arduino sends back Arduino LED turned on Arduino LED turned off and this text appears here in the text log